Hi, my name is Kapil Pandit. I am a chartered accountant and I have been working with Bain Capital for the past two years. When I got a call from one Mr. Akshay Kapoor from PwC to announce me as the uh, winner of the Predict the Winner Challenge, my initial reaction was I was quite thrilled because there was just one prize up for grabs. I used to actively participate in quiz competitions while I was in college. In fact, I've been the captain of the college quiz team. Unlike other quiz competitions where we generally test you uh, on your existing knowledge about few topics, this quiz was quite unique. For the financial markets related questions uh, such as the RBI reference rate for rupee dollar or uh, for that matter the Brent crude price on MCX, I just check what were the prevailing prices in the, in the earlier few days, what was the short term trend uh, for those particular indices. It was a combination of my knowledge about sports as well as gut feel. So for instance, predicting the winner of the men's 100 meter race in the Olympics, Usain Bolt was the obvious choice. For some other questions, my existing knowledge and a little bit of gut feel as well. For predicting the winner of the ICC T20 championship, the options were England, Australia, India and South Africa. And the fifth option was uh, any other team. My thought process was like, England, they don't have any uh, star players in their lineup. Australia, like England, had very few stars. So again, uh, Australia was out of contention for me. South Africa had a bunch of quality players, but I thought that South Africa has this habit of choking in crunch moments. So that's why I eliminated them. And India, again, I was my heart was saying probably India could win the championship, but then India had its perennial woes like the batting combination or its uh, weakness in the bowling department. Within those teams, I was betting on either West Indies or Sri Lanka. West Indies had a lot of star players in their lineup and uh, Sri Lanka had home advantage. I used to follow Grand Prix a lot uh, while in college, especially when Narayan Karthigain uh, came on to the big league. Uh, but later on, after passing out for, from college, uh, my interest also dropped to an extent. Uh, I really appreciate PwC for organizing this whole event. I am going to uh, experience the thrill of watching an F1 race that too live and from the main grandstand and I am quite excited about it.